Hey everyone, I'm Joel on the road, and today my UNESCO World Heritage Journey is at Brunnebuen, the archaeological site in Ireland. Brunnebuen is a complex of burial mounds from the Neolithic era, 5,000 years old. I'm standing in front of one of them, Newgrange, and it predates both the Great Pyramids and Stonehenge. Now behind me you can see three different types of stone and they're all quarried from very different places which you might think of as unusual for a Neolithic society but it apparently was quite common. The huge curbstones at the bottom are only from a couple of miles away, while the white quartz that you can see, and of course the round grey granite in the middle of it, those are actually from two different places as well, about 50 kilometres that way and that way. One of the key features of the passage tomb here is the light box just above the door where on the mid-winter solstice at sunrise the sun rises over the hills and shines directly onto the main burial tomb. We've just been inside and seen a demonstration. It is absolutely unbelievable. This is the burial mound of now and it's the other of the main burial chambers that are here at Brunaboyne. But this one is quite different to Newgrange that we saw earlier. It's much more of a cemetery complex because in addition to this large mound here, there's also 18 smaller satellite mounds dotted around. And they've found hundreds of bodies here rather than just a handful that were found at Newgrange. Now the fascinating thing about all of the artwork here is that it's entirely abstract. There's no depictions of plants, animals or people. So we don't really know what it is or what it's for. It could be hieroglyphs, it could be religious symbols, we just don't know. It's just been so fascinating to see the well-preserved remains of ancient cultures and just their artwork is so spectacular and interesting. It's been really fascinating. But that's it from me. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm Joel on the Road and I'll see you at the next World Heritage Site.